Hello guys, here are the 5 weapons of Meliodas. Oh, 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 One giant broadsword. Meliodas used this sword in the Holy War 3000 years ago, also used it when he was the leader of the Ten Commandments. The sword is at least twice the size of Meliodas. It was broken in the battle Meliodas and the goddess Elizabeth fought and lost against the demon king and the supreme deity. The sword did not show any traits of being able to use an ability like the sacred treasure. 2. Dragon Handle Meliodas used this broken sword in conjunction with full counter. The sword also appears to have abilities of its own and is one of the keys to the coffin of eternal darkness. 3. Liz's sword. Once Meliodas regained his lover's sword, Liz, Meliodas started using it after his dragon handle was stolen. It also works in conjunction with full counter. It was broken during Meliodas' fight with an Albion. 4. Lost Vein. As a member of the Seven Deadly Sins, Meliodas possesses a sacred treasure. Lost Vein is a demon splitting sword which he sold at a pawn shop in Camelot for money to fund the Boar Hat ten years ago. It is later returned to him by Merlin, who is revealed to have purchased the sword and kept it safe all this time. Its ability to Sergo Bunshin is compatible with Meliodas' full counter allowing him to use it as much more dangerous levels. 5. Bone Sword in Purgatory, Meliodas' emotions created a sword, made with the bones of the indigenous species, with a single-edged long blade. The blade is compatible with Meliodas' full counter. If you have any suggestions or you want to know about 7 Deadly Sins, please comment down below and please like subscribe and smash the notification bell for more 7 Deadly Sin video. Thank you see you and goodbye.